Hey, what's up gamers? My name is Skella Mystic. Welcome back to my advanced fishing series called Catch It Fast, where I attempt to catch a particular type or species of fish in less than 10 minutes of gameplay. Today we're in Crocotopia looking for a balance rare called the Crocotopian Eel. Now this fish occurs in the oasis and in the entrance hall and in the Emperor's Retreat. It is a balanced rare, like I said, and it is one of the harder rares to catch. So we're going to go ahead and get started and see if we can bring him in. I have 58 minutes on my timer. Now I see a lot of fire fish in here that we're going to have to be eliminated. So we're going to go ahead and do that first. I think I got them all. That's about half of the fish that were here. That's going to make it a little bit tougher. All the rest of these are balanced like we want. The Crocotopian eel, I've tried for it a couple of times and you don't always get it. It, uh, like I said, it's, it's not one of the easier rares to catch. I might have to go into the entrance hall or all the way into the Emperor's Retreat to get to it. Now to get into the Emperor's Retreat, I've cast that too far. To get into the Emperor's Retreat, as you can see on my buttons there, I've got the, the red and blue button open that shows I've been in the Emperor's Retreat and will allow me to resume the dungeon. I do this because there's a little bit of gameplay or quest line that you have to do to be able to get in there. And if you have on a fishing potion or a fishing timer, you will waste about 10 minutes of it just doing that quest line stuff. So I always go there without a potion on, open the quest line and get myself into that dungeon, and then I use the resume function to fish there later whenever I fish this out if I haven't caught what I wanted. Got too far again. Back it up real quick. These guys are right on the shore. There we go. I see five left in here. It's five chances. Of the three fishing areas that are available for the Croctopian eel, I like this one the best just because there's generally the most fish and the most fishing area. Inside the entrance hall and inside the Emperor's Retreat, I have to listen to him. Yep, there he goes. Inside the uh, entrance hall and inside the Emperor's Retreat, the fishing holes are a lot smaller and there's less fish, which means less chance to get that eel. Also in there, it's a, a cliff base or a fishing pool type system where you can't get in and you can't eliminate the fish that you don't want. The other schools of fish. So it makes it harder to catch the balanced fish without an ice or a death or what have you getting in the way. I got another big boy coming right at it. And as you know, if you watch my other videos, I do not like getting in the water to catch the fish because a lot of times they'll sneak up behind you and get scared away. Especially after you've separated out the ones you want. And it's a big fat decoy. I gotta get up out of here. It was that, it was that fellow splashing out the fish. I was, <laughs> I was concerned a fish was getting scared out. It was that player. Alright. Get, right get right in his face. Throw it right in there and try to, try to knock him out with the lure. I don't want to hit him, but... It didn't work. There you go. You should bite this time. Ah, we got him. I find a lot of decoys in this pond. There's supposed to be a couple other types of balanced fish in here. And the Crocotopia Neal is one of them. But I often don't see anything in this as far as the balanced fish go, but decoys. I don't know what happened there. That was weird. All right, two chances left here. Now another gameplay trick that I use is, oh, that's first bite, awesome. Another trick that I use is that whenever I'm fishing this pool and I pretty well don't think I'm gonna get what I want, I already set my teleport button up to go to the entrance hall. And then I can go from the oasis, teleport to the entrance hall. If I don't get my fish there, I can go right into the Emperor's Retreat using that resume dungeon button and use a lot less time walking around and a lot more time fishing. He's thinking about it. There he goes. He backs way up though. That's not a, that's not a good sign. 
He's backing way up and taking his time. And that's usually a decoy. That's another thing I don't like as far as the balance fishing goes. These mainstream decoys seem like they're everywhere. You, you, you go turn your bed over and there's a, there's, a <laughs> there's a balance decoy under it. All right, we didn't get him here. So we're gonna take our shortcut and pour up to the entrance hall. And this is gonna help us to catch this fish in under 10 minutes. We've got some fish in here. Let's see what we've got. Oh good, they're all balanced. I like it when that happens. You don't have to try to sort out any death or whatever else. Or, actually, I think it's only life on this side. Basically, you don't have to sort out any other kind of fish though. And that's always good. guy coming around. I think I will. Nah, he's going to be a minute. There, I'll try to catch it this way. I've got about four minutes left of my timer, give or take. And I've caught a lot of fish, but not the eel. I think that my best chance for catching the eel is in these two little pools, though. I think I've seen it more often in here than I have outside or in the Emperor's Retreat. And there he is. <laughs> just about to, I was just talking about you, buddy. There he is, our Croctopian eel. And we've got him in under 10 minutes. And I think that being as we have, we're gonna fish for one more, we'll, we'll extend this a little bit. We'll fish for one more fish and see what we can get. But we've got our eel already, which is a good thing. All right. I expect to find just, just other balance. Oh, wow! That's two eels in a row. That just does not happen. That is so cool. I'm glad that happened for you guys to see in this video. Let's go for three. Wow, not that, not that I want to be greedy or anything, but that is just too unreal. Well, now I got a decoy. That's about what you get. Now we're back into normal fishing. We're not in fantasy land anymore. I do want to catch that great big balance shadow. That would, that would be just too cool if that was a crocotopian eel giant. A whopper, you know what I mean. There we go. I just have to fish this out. Come on, whopper. Too good. Uh, that's a treasure chest. That's all right, I do, I've already got my treasure. A couple of fish back. Him. I am I am I am so happy that happened for you guys. That is gonna make for an exciting video. Alright, one bite down. He's not backing up far though, so uh, maybe not. There's two bites. And another treasure chest. This might be the this might be in the doubling period. Two crocs, then two balance, then two chests. This last guy is not wanting to talk to me at all. And I don't have I don't have enough level yet to have the call fish button where it makes them come to you. I think you get that uh, rank nine. Maybe it's rank ten. But I think you get it at rank nine. Although the way I'm going, I'll hit rank nine pretty soon. So I'm gonna get in this guy's way, but it's the best angle on the fish. Right, right onto him, there we go. One bite. At this point, it doesn't matter if it's a decoy. <laughs> you catch two eels in a row, you have nothing more to ask for. That's two bites. Three. I can, I can just about tell now ahead of time. Remember that toilet was three. Wow. This has got to be a record. That is three crocotopian eels out of the same pool in less than 10 minutes. You cannot ask for more than that. All right, being as we've done so good, I am going to close this video out happily and move on to the next one and give you a new fish to catch. As always, if you enjoyed my video, please like and subscribe. Maybe leave me a comment about another series or game you'd like me to play or just to talk to me because I like that too. This is Skeleton Mystic reminding you that whatever else you do, always love the game. Peace.
And there she is, the owlfish. Tell me that don't look like a grandma. <laughs> All right. Well, we've got our target fish. So that's gonna that's make a basically that'll make us a short video. We're gonna go ahead and end it now.